So right now the screen region is a little bit, a little bit messed up, but don't worry about that. Look at this. Remember username and hide username. That means I can slap in my very long username and you can't see it. Then it's pretty hard to see if you've uh, if you've typoed or not. So yeah, if I closed the client right now and then reopened it, it would uh, remember the usernames that I've ticked that little box. But now let's log in and see what's actually happened. So, oh no, it's loading. What does that mean? All right. So another thing I'm going to show you is right here, special attack tool tips. So now when you hover over the special attack, it tells you what, exactly what the special attack does along with its name. So Toxic Siphon, deal an attack that inflicts 50% more damage and heals you 50% of the damage. Then 50% at the end means how much special attack it takes. Same thing with a Warhammer. And you're thinking, but mate, that's gonna get in the way. Same thing with these prayer tool tips, like I'm flicking and they, they're getting in the way, man. Well, now you could turn them off. So if we go to the, to the little spanner right here, then smack the advanced options button, then right here you've got tooltips. Hovering over prayers it displays tooltips currently on. It is currently on. Let's turn it off. <gasps> Magic. And same thing with uh, the special attack bar display. So at the moment I can see the uh, information. Now I can't. Again, that's just spanner and then advanced options. Now you're also probably thinking, Jake, mate, why are you run into abyssal site? You're gonna get kill yourself because he's dangerous. Well, in fact, I'm actually gonna show you something. So now they made it made abyssal site a little bit easier. So. Against these respiratory systems, your Slayer Hound buffs now work, so you get the extra damage and accuracy buff. So, like, hopefully you won't be uh, running out of time to kill both these respiratory systems before he becomes unstunned, if you even have done the Abyssal Sire and know what I'm talking about. But yes, you do more damage against these now when you're on task, but you can only kill Abyssal Sire on task anyway, so yeah. See, I didn't make it clear before uh, you didn't get the uh, damage buff when you're on task against the respiratory systems. Which sort of makes sense since they're not abyssal demons, but they are like a part of the sire because you have to kill them to kill him. And while we're here, we're just gonna get a bonus. You can get yourself a bonus kill. Let's see if we get an unside, bro. One unside, please. Oh, we didn't get it. That's unfortunate. Now then, moving on. So let's head on over to the Warriors Guild. And you remember when you would have to collect tokens from this place, and you have to like right-click, use the rune stuff on the on the magical altimeter, or like this magical thing. Now you can just left-click and put it there. And so I probably shouldn't have got full rune because th this guy's gonna be hard to kill. But now you just left-click and it puts it on there. So there's no there's no annoying there's no annoying right-click, left-click, and then plonk it on there. And also you'll notice that. When you get these things to low HP, before, oh, I just one hit it, but still. Before, when you get these to low HP, they would just retreat. Now they don't retreat. They never retreat. They would walk to like the corner of the room, and uh, yeah, that was annoying. And uh, that is the majority of all the changes and bug fixes um, this week. If you would like to look at the other bug fixes, they are listed in the news post, which is linked in the description as always. And next Tuesday, mates, hard crime and episode number three, something very exciting happens. Yes, no more spoilers. All right, all right that's it.